You are now watching, by the minute, where we highlight unsolved cases across the nation. Getting involved in your community is simple, you start with doing things that you love that in return, help bring the community together. For one man, he served our nation, his community, and inspired the youth until one day, he was taken from us. Charleston, South Carolina. September 21, 2001. John Jenkins, 68, was a Vietnam veteran and one of the first prominent black business owners in the east side where he owned an upscale jazz club named Club Basin Street. The east side was a predominantly black area and the city of Charleston neglected to supply the residents with proper municipal services while increasing their police presence with violence, brutality, and even death. Communities and businesses would fail and John's business would reach the same fate. But that did not stop him from becoming a beacon in his community. John began mentoring and assisting mothers with their young sons. Mothers would look to John for advice and young men would seek a leader. Woefully, a community would lose an angel. On September 21, 2010, around 3.30 a.m., police would receive a call for shots fired at 18 Hanover. Police would arrive and find John shot multiple times in the roadway in front of St. John's Episcopal Church. John would succumb to his injuries at the scene. The most unfortunate part of this story is that, there are witnesses who saw what happened to John and have refused to cooperate with authorities. It's been over 10 years since John's murder. Whatever reason that held you back from helping authorities solve this case, should not continue to keep you from doing the right thing. There is no stronger force than a community that stands together. John stood for us and generations to come and he does not deserve to have his case stay cold. We have to get the suspect in custody, unless you want to let a suspect get away with murder in our community, by the minute. Police need our help, while the identity is known but hidden, there are people out there that have tips to help us solve this case. If you have any information about this case please contact the Charleston Police Department Cold Case Unit. If you are someone who knows what happened to John, do the right thing. You do not want to harbor the secret of a murderer. Their guilt and wrongdoing should not sit on your heart, when you did not commit this crime. Help us get this suspect in custody. There are unsolved cases like this across the nation that we can help authorities solve together. We keep our communities safe by letting criminals know, crimes will not be tolerated and justice prevails. Help us get answers to the authorities so the East Side community of Charleston can receive justice for John. Until then, a community seeks answers, by the minute. Thank you for watching By the Minute News, be sure to like and subscribe if you want more true crime stories from all over the nation.